Okay, so this is another, like, cave thing, but... So, my guess... Is you have to use a special type of chocobo to break these caves open. And then on top of that, you need a chocobo that can get here. Because there's no chocobo tracks. And then there's something special in that cave. Knights of the Round or something. As much as I want to go do Choco Hot and Cold, I think we're going to go to the castle. Also going to M Zones. We are on disc 3. We're about to go to Ibsen's castle. And thank you very much for asking in advance. I appreciate that. We just got the airship, Booker, so you didn't miss too much. <laughs> Who knew I could do math? You'll be sorry. Alright, I've been wanting to go here ever since I saw it. Zooming around on the ship. Is this the old castle Hilda's told us about? What a strange looking place. Like it's upside down or something. Kind of looks like Alexander. Alright, I'll take three of you with me. The rest of you secure this spot. Hey, Zidane. What's up, Amaranth? I work alone. Always have, always will. I don't know why you bother carrying dead weight all the time. What's your point? I'm saying working alone beats working in a team any day, and I'm going to prove it. Hilda said there's some key here to break the seal, am I right? Yeah. Let's see who finds it first. I'll be going by myself, of course. Amaranth, you selfish, ignorant fool! Calm down, Rusty. But... Okay. I don't know what you're thinking, but if that's what you want, it's okay by me. Well, aren't you an agreeable fellow? Well, see you later. Are you sure about this, side aim? What can I do? I can't change the way he thinks. Let's get going, everyone. We'll beat Amaran at his own game. Amaranth's dead. <laughs> I love that this is, uh... the same tune, but it's, like, off. <laughs> See, that's, a, that's an interesting use. That's an interesting use of the same melody. It's like... The melody, but something's wrong. <laughs> it gives you a very good feeling of what's to come. Also, received dagger. Like a literal just dagger. Great. You memeing on me? Aquarius. Aquarius. Oh! Aquarius. Who kissed Virgo? Well, who did? How's it going, Milk Truck? What? burn it with fire. I don't like it. That's a Cerberus. A weird Cerberus. Wow, 
might want Beast Killer in this dungeon. I'm already spooked. Holy crap, Dagger! The damage. Freya is just... That Holy Spear is so strong. What's funny is Freya wasn't really that strong up to this point. Like, she was always about as strong as Zidane was, but... That was kind of it. Do not be restricted by your knowledge and experience. This place turns logic upside down. What's big is small, what's strong is weak, and heaven is earth. I could tell just from the music that, like, it was going to have some weird gimmick. I find it funny that, uh... That the Mog would have all this equipment sitting around. His deep pockets. A letter, Koopo, how unusual. I'm so happy, Koopo. Hey, Kamul, how are you, Koopo? Us Moogles and Limblum are all wondering the same thing these days. Where the heck is Bognat Central? No one knows, Koopo. Do you know where it is, Kumul? It's supposedly very, very far, and you can't enter very easily, Koopo. I heard that you can't enter Mognat Central unless you're riding on a chocobo, Koopo. Oh, that's an actual hint. Maybe that's what's on that island. I think. That doesn't really work for anyone. Got your new helmet. Wait, you can equip Lamia's tiara. That's interesting. Uh, you already have this stuff, but it's not a bad helmet. this, just because it's got some good stats. Magic evasion down to zero, though. Kind of yikes. Also, I have some abilities to equip, maybe. Uh, let's see here. Really need ability up anymore. Why not? Give you high tide, that's fun. I don't really need chemist anymore. Everyone clear-headed since confusion is the worst. Look at Freya go, dude. Auto haste, HP plus 30, MP plus 10. I should give you... 
should give you accuracy up. Accuracy up's actually kind of nice. Freya, big, strong. Vivi's looking pretty strong, too. How's it going, Dio Whore? My best friend and I finished our playthrough of Final Fantasy IX yesterday. It was my first time. He nearly cried. I absolutely cried. <laughs> I feel that. I, uh... I get choked up really easily with... Not really, not, for whatever reason, not games as much. But, uh, but movies. I, like, get choked up every single movie I watch, even if it's not supposed to be, like, it's not supposed to make you choke up. Something about just the experience of watching a movie gets me every time. So what's going on here? We got a gargoyle. Can I, can I attack the Gargoyle? Because he looks... Let's give him a soft. He's looking kind of hard. Oh, he did it for me. Beat me to it. Became too soft to live. What? <laughs> became too soft to live. That's fantastic. <laughs> Turned into a puddle. I figured something would happen if I used the soft on him before he activated, but I didn't think after he activated it would do something. Also, this guy takes like no damage. I wonder if he only takes magic damage. the gargoyle. He has so much health. Yeah, I have three characters with auto haste, so that means that my ATB bar actually moves like normal speed. <laughs> Instead of crawls across the screen like normal. Oh. Alright. Interesting. It's an Alec main. It's probably called like Airman or something. But why? Why can't they just come up with a name for this enemy? Every every game, they give it another weird name. It never has the same name. Although veteran is kind of fitting because he's in a bunch of the games. I kind of like that name actually. It's just funny because he never has a different. It's always. It never has the same name, it's always different. Do you not have a Suna? I thought you did. Scuba Stan. 
Alright. Is it going to take down? Yeah, this is Ibsen's castle. Did I ever figure out the mechanics? Uh, they're bad. So, yes. Holy guacamole, that damage. Okay. There's some kind of weird gimmick going on here, I think. Well, I can only jump deal damage. Seems like there's some kind of mechanic where, like, either stuff has a ton of defense in this dungeon, or, like, attacks that are supposed to do a lot of damage don't or something because of the reverse mechanic. I don't know. But for some reason, jump just says, no, I do damage anyways. Guess you're not supposed to go this way. Mm -hmm. I don't want that chest. That's why Dagger does a lot of damage. The less damage you do, the better. Then for some reason, Jump just does a million damage anyways. Here, this normally does one damage. God dang it. <laughs> Never lucky. Alright, well, regular fire still does crap damage, so I don't know. idea how this works, but I know that Freya does all the damage. Also, Thievery always does a bunch of damage. Became too soft to live. That is one of the greatest combat texts I've ever seen. Right next to uh, Attack While It's Tails Up. How's it going, Super Fuzz? Right, we learned Auto Float. Wow. All you have left to get his healer. That chest. <laughs> I 
<laughs> Why does it do that little jerky movement? Dang, this, this is going to be quite the maze. Now listen, can you not just reach over and grab the other chest? Like, come on, side in. Was that a javelin? Wait a second. I think... I think I just had an, uh, a moment. Give the same strength. <laughs> Still doesn't explain why Freya does a bajillion damage, but. Oh! Wow, Vivi not even looking the right way still dodges. Holy cow, look at that. Question is, will jump do more or less damage now? weird though because magic is still like normal but it seems like they all have really high magic defense it's like the lower magic was still doing no damage and, like comet still did okay damage but yeah in case you missed that i equipped everyone's starting weapon and it's all doing more damage the reason I realized it is because I've picked up three or two starting weapons now in chests. So, like, the, the chests are trying to tell me the gimmick. That's definitely really cool. <laughs> These stupid ladders. Just have them stop where they stop. Squeaky, squeaky, squeak, 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 squeaky, dee, dee, squeak, squeak, squeaky, squeaky, squeak, squeak, squeak. <laughs> that would be pretty funny if you got all the way through this dungeon and didn't realize the gimmick and you're just like, wow, the chests in here sucked. <laughs> the chests in here gave me the worst equipment. See if this just uh oh nope it kills him. Yeah, Zinane's doing some big damage now. Oh, Vivi with the demon. Demon number. I should put Vivi and Dagger in the front row. Actually, Dagger, I think... Dagger is okay in the back row, I think. Because she... It's ranged. I just put Vivi in the front row. Okay, Spear is doing less damage now. What? What is this mechanic? <laughs> I'm very confused. I think I'm going to put Holy Lance back on and just jump with Freya. Because for some reason, it's still doing massive damage. No, it definitely applies to jump because, well, no, I guess, I guess that's what's happening is that it's not applying to jump. 
don't know why, but it's not. It might only be straight up the attack command. But then, like, to make it actually worth it to put on the bad weapons, they made everything in this dungeon have, like, really high magic defense. So you can't just spam magic. This is strange. Let's just do nothing with it. Maybe it's just me. When in doubt, punch it some more. Try something drastic. Now we're talking. Yes, he's gonna sit and go through the floor. Oh, no. Yep. <laughs> I, uh, 100% saw that coming. Really good equipment that I already have. Also, we have autonomous, so we can start learning Leviathan. They did, but it was a had to be a super song. Doom. How dare you, Doom, my boy? Vivi smacking him with the 1k damage. G Force 199! about you guys but my entire life has changed forever after seeing that <laughs> I don't know if I can like continue on with the same same way I've been living my life this might be a, a true turning point you don't just see that and then just continue on with your life as normal. How's it going, Baden? Maybe, maybe it is, man. Maybe my whole life has really been a lie up to this point. I've seen the, the truth. And the truth is the giant mouth in the sky. Who's the better gravity summon? I like, I've always liked Diablos a lot. Oh, no. Uh, Code Red. There's three of them, too. Oh, 
Oh good, I'm glad I pronounced your name right. I try, but it's not always possible. Especially since people pronounce their names in way, whatever way they want, so I just have to guess. Where are you going? <laughs> What's he doing? Scan them. We got a little uh, conga line going on. Let's check out Leviathan. Also, I do not do much damage. I'm gonna try Demi. A lot of times, Tom Berries are weak against Demi. Also, Al. What? Oh, he bumped into his buddy. I'm up, Comet. We, uh... Did he just... Okay. <laughs> what is this, Donberry Chess? Vivi! Wow, I did like no damage. So they just walk up, kill somebody, and leave. I'm gonna kill one to see what I get, but I don't think that's happening. Oh. <laughs> the perfect grind. That was interesting. I mean, at least, uh, at least they don't game over you. Just kill you and leave. Uh-oh. You're late, Zidane, and I'm the winner. See how much time you lose by working with others? Have you figured out how to break the seal? Take a look at that wall. Maybe you can figure it out. <laughs> I love, I love, I love his thought process. I'm better than you because I got here first, but now I need your help to figure it out. Because <laughs> I don't know how to do it. But it's no longer my concern. What do you mean? I proved myself right. I don't need to follow you around anymore. We may be enemies next time we meet. See ya. Oh, he's gone. It's his way. We can't change him. Let's get going. By the way, I don't really know what to do. I mean, maybe... I guess the way he said it was like I didn't even try to figure it out, but he could be bluffing. He could have tried to figure it out and failed. Guess we don't know. All right, I don't want to do that yet. I'm dead. I love how this room has its own little arena. me with that crap.
I'm the real Vivi. Just got an idea. Yeah, that enemy was pretty cool. Okay, this is that chest I passed up before. So I guess it worked out. Check this out. Fight where Luna is actually good. Correct. We have a Final Fantasy VII surprise later, so we'll just be playing this till lunch. Look at Vivi, he just stands there through death. Oh. Holy, look at that damage. Because of, uh, because of that little, like, red ball that appears over your head when you're berserked, the veteran looked like a bomb. Looked like he had like a little lighter, like a fuse on the top of his head. Rod. Is that for you? Yeah. I need to put you in the front right now. I'm hoping that. Whatever the boss is in here, it has like super magic defense, so you actually have to use the mechanic to beat them. Be kind of cool. How could you do this? I don't know how to get rid of this. Fight is so goofy, but it's so memorable. Like, you'll never forget that time you just randomly fought a freaking airship. Now I can just sit here and drink my coffee and watch my party members go to work. Oh my god. Oh my god, that damage. Yo, Prayer of War, thank you so much for the $15 donation. Hey Dutch, just wanted to say looking forward to when you get to Final Fantasy X. Also wanted to break the chat by saying again that Titus is my all-time favorite Final Fantasy character. May chat have mercy on you. And Chris, thank you so much for the three-month prime. Thank you, thank you very, very much. I appreciate it.
let's see. There's something written on it. My power is protected high atop a fiery mountain. Let's see. This one, too. My power is protected underwater, surrounded by the earth. My power is protected behind a tornado. My power is protected under the shaking ground. Well, looks like we got what we came here for. Let's go. You were staring at that mirror for a long time. Anything interesting? Like Hilda said, those things on the wall must have something to do with the seal. Let's think about that later. We need to get out. The mirror. Return. To me. Who's there? Energy flow interrupted. Energy 2. Terra. You dare get in the way of Terra's master plan? What is this? My name is Taharka. Return my mirrors. You should say please when you ask for things. Fool, you'll regret this. Ah, I already regret it. My ears. Falcon. I would like that. It's time to play. Get that steel. Nice. Compact. He doesn't look very compact. I got the elixir on the first try. Uh, this boy's taking like no damage. Okay, now he might take damage. Magic still does damage, so we don't really need to do the gimmick. I really wish Shell lasted longer. Man, I really want this steel, but... Wayside in trance. If only trance wasn't dumb. Steam version? No, it has to be the PS4 version. Or any of the versions that came from the PS4 version, like the Steam version. Still curled. I think he is. <laughs> so 
an interesting fight. Stealing. Likes that one spell. Let's try to like put him to sleep or something. That won't work though. Going Star Atlas. Still can't steal. <laughs> He's asleep, but I still can't get it. Oh my god. Why is this so. Why? Why is stealing so bad? I don't understand. You would make it so bad, even this late in the game. It's still impossible to steal anything. Stealing is fine, you just have bad luck. I wholeheartedly disagree with you. There's no way my luck is this bad. Finally. There he is. The OG Danger Noodle himself. Especially since water seems to be a really good element in this game. Why did you do no damage? Oh, is he curled? Snake. That's Leviathan animation. It's definitely up there.
this boss is, uh... Kinda lame. <laughs> like, he just uses Blazaga. And sometimes takes less damage. I mean, he is a bit cooler because you have to work with the mechanic of the dungeon. But you can also just smack him with Comet, so... abilities, because it seems like abilities go through the gimmick. Gee, I wonder if it'll be Blazaga. have a pretty good amount of health. And he's dead. Got Leviathan. I can start learning uh, Bahamut. One is all. All is one. You'll never break the seal. Back to confused flute music. What exactly is that? Stop? Why is Freya in the back row? No wonder she's doing less damage. Maybe she isn't. She looked like she was. No, she wasn't. Maybe she just kind of takes a step back when she gets ready to attack or something. Does it definitely look... Definitely looked like she was in the back row. You done learning this yet? Yep. So now... The heck is mating? I'm gonna give you the ribbon. Or... This. Dude, the ribbon is... Really strong. Alright. The dude that blew up an entire freaking city is now in my arsenal. The, the chanting in the background of this song. Go down here. Yep. 
Yeah, this is a cool dungeon. Cool, uh, cool layout. Cool gimmick. Memorable. Still don't know how to get that chest. Kind of upset about it. Towards the screen, I wonder. I mean, it's probably a starting weapon for someone, so I probably shouldn't be that worried about it, but... Yo, Sid, thank you so much for the bits! It doesn't tell you the gimmick, but it gives you a bunch of starting weapons in chests, so you can kind of figure it out from there. Here comes that boy. I don't know if that's my, I mean, I think Bahama Zero will always be my favorite summoning animation. But I feel like that was one of the strongest summoning animations. Like, you felt the power in that one. Like, holy cow. Like, I like how powerful he felt. Yeah, it is a bit long. With long animations, like, it's cooler the first time you use it, but then less cool every every time you use it after that, you know? Like, nothing beats the first time you see Bahama Zero, but then after that it's like, okay, we speed this up. <laughs> Same with Knights of the Round, yeah, it's like, the first time you see Knights of the Round, you just keep thinking it's over and it's not, and you're like, oh my god, how many... <laughs> Especially since it's doing more and more hits. Like, well, Bahama Zero, it's only one hit. So you're like, okay, just waiting for the damage to hit. But the first time you summon Knights of the Round, and it just keeps bam, 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 and you're like, oh my god, how many more hits is it gonna do? It's like really epic. But then after that, you're like, all right. Pretty much other than like two enemies in the game, Knights of the Round one shots everything. So when you summon it, you're like, okay, we don't need all this. Like, we obviously killed him. <laughs> we don't need to watch this whole thing. Like, he's dead. Yeah. Stop, he's already dead. It's over the top, but that's the point. Like, that's what makes it so great. Because you have to go so out of your way to get it that it's, you know, that's the whole point of it is that it's over the top. Like, who would ever survive this? Oh, for sure. <laughs> for sure you can win a fight quicker without him. In every case. Omni Slash does barely less damage and it's like a tenth of the time of Knights of the Round. 